Hello folks. Today I'm going to do a quick review on this little gadget. The Visor Cat wash wipe system. You may have seen it on some other channels. Uh, if you're interested on what I think of it, stick around. Today I'm going to do a quick review on this little gadget, the VisorCat wash wipe system. VisorCat have not sent me this, I have purchased this with my own money. Let's look at that straight away. What you're looking at is around about 35 to 40 pounds depending on where you get it. If you go direct to VisorCat.com uh, they will send you one of these and a small bottle of uh, cleaning solution for around £40. So what have you got? It's breaking, basically broken down into two parts. Solution reservoir in here and then the wiping system itself here. You've got wiper blades, two wiper blades there and another blade there. That opens up and you then have a sponge which soaks up the solution from the reservoir onto that sponge there. All you do is you put it on a gloved hand like that, pull it tight and then it sits on your wrist like that. That's how I perfectly have it. You can do it on a single finger or you can put it on your thumb so it sits on your thumb like that if you so desire. What you do is you simply refill the reservoir there, wire here, using the supplied bottle of solution. You do get instructions with this, so if you want to know how to do it, and all you do, pull this little plug out of the way, gently pump in the solution into the reservoir, like so. Resecure the cap, and then the fluid is soaked from the reservoir down this channel to the sponge. I'll just soak the sponge as well, just so you get an idea what it looks like when it's done. And there you have it. I'm just going to give you a quick demonstration on how it actually works. So I've got a visor here. So all you do is you clean it, you run it the sponge across the front like that, and then simply wipe back across. And all that does is it just puts the solution onto the visor, and then you wipe back across the other way, removes the, the gunk and crap off the visor. As I say, I've used this in some hideous weather conditions and to be fair, it's been a godsend. It really has been a godsend. I've had this a couple of years now uh, and it's worth its weight in gold. They really are a genuinely good bit of kit, especially if you do a lot of touring or commuting. Uh, I've also used this with work uh, where we've been riding around in some god awful weather conditions and it has actually done its job. It's one of those items that I genuinely can recommend highly. As I said at the top of the video, uh, VisorCat have not sent me this item for review and I've purchased this out of my own money and it genuinely is a lovely, usable bit of kit. When it's on your wrist, you don't even know it's there. You really don't even know it's there. So I say you just tighten it up. What I tend to do is this extra strap that shut pulls that tight, I just tuck that down on the inside of the glove like that, and that just hides it out of the way, stops that piece from flapping around, and then it just sits on my glove like that, so that all I have to do is just wipe my face. Uh, come the day 
when we are allowed out back on the bikes or if you are a commuter it's one of those items i can highly recommend okay speak to you soon cheers if you like the channel and you like the reviews please consider subscribing and hit the notification button thanks and i'll see you soon